Hey everybody, um, I'm getting ready to go out tonight. It's November 30th, and um, the river's up, pretty up, but it's uh, not really stained. But it is high, and they are running some current tonight, but nothing crazy. Um, water temp still in the 60, 61 degree range, and um, got about four hours of generating before they shut it off. And I figured I'd come out here and give it a try for a little bit. Um, these are the conditions where you can get some good numbers of fish. I don't know if I'll pull anything big tonight, but uh, whenever you get an opportunity, when the conditions are right, even if it's at night, you gotta go. You gotta go when the river, when the conditions are good. Um, so, I'll give it a try tonight see if anything comes of it but uh let me get everything situated we'll go out there and throw some baits see what happens this is the first anchor tonight uh, driving out here i didn't see a lot of fish on the sonar i checked a couple of different spots on the way out here and just not seeing anything really at all the fish no big marks or anything like that so I did mark a couple of better fish. There's like a 50 foot hole right off the back of the boat right here. So the lines aren't casted out far. They're literally right off the back of the boat. But with the water tent being a little cooler, I'll probably sit here for a while and just see if I pick anything up. It's in a current swing, main channels, right on the channel edge pretty much. And uh, maybe, there'll, maybe there'll be something here, I don't know. Really not optimistic. Uh, just not marking any fish. But we'll sit here for a little while and see what happens. All right, I've given it about 40, 45 minutes here. Uh, had a couple of little small bites, but nothing serious. Um, I may run down to the dam just because it's been it's been producing so good uh, here as of late. So um, didn't get anything here, but I'm gonna get these up run to another spot and uh, I may just go to the dam and sit there for the rest of the night because the past few nights I've been there I've done really well so let me get these up we'll go well I'm back at the dam because this seems to be where most of the fish are I don't know if they're collecting what, what heat goes off that wall or they're enjoying the current break there but I'm going to fish the point of that wall again like I have been doing and uh, see if anything happens. Um, caught a good channel cat here the other night, biggest one I've ever caught here. So The fish are here, so we'll give it a shot see what happens. Been here five minutes. Is that? That is officially probably the biggest channel cat I've ever caught. That is a big channel cat for, for this water. See all the spots on him. That's a big channel. That didn't take long, about five minutes, if that.
8.6 minus 7, so 7 pound 15 ounce channel cap. It's not a bad channel cat at all, right there. Put him back. There he goes. There's a good Good fish. Solid fish right there. That fish is probably he's got some weight to him. He's heavy. He's probably 20, 25 pounds. Good fish. Again. Well, he gave me a nice send off. Gosh, the mutt. Man, don't tear your hands up. Good bye. Ain't much to this one, but it's a fish. Chunky fish. back so you can get another one.
it's fixing to start raining and I really don't want to be out here in the rain so probably gonna call it a night got two fish out here two anchors kind of slow but sometimes it's like that but, uh, one of the fish was really good and that was a good CPR fish that's definitely one you want to let go it'd be a big one someday but that's it for me tonight I ain't gonna get caught out here in the rain